My name is Victoria Vengeance, and I'm one of the producers of the Viva Las Vegas Rockabilly Weekend Burlesque Competition. It's very simple. The girls just get up there and let, let loose and do what they do and just put on a, a good show, and it's just a very basic striptease. I'm Chacha Valor. I'm from um, Las Vegas. Uh, I started um, dancing three years ago with a local troupe here in Vegas called Babes and Sin Burlesque. I'm still part of that troupe. Those are my girls, or my best friends, or like my sisters. I'm a registered nurse, and I have this whole other, you know, I'm like, I have this Clark Kent Superman life where I have to go to work and be a nurse. I work in an ICU, I work in critical care, all that, and then, you know, have this whole burlesque life too, which is totally fun. I don't try to be the sex pot or the sex kitten. I try to just to like get the crowd going. Why don't you introduce yourself? Hi everyone, I'm Vivacious. Tonight I am stage kittening for the burlesque competition. I entered Viva, I didn't make it, but I am new at this. I'm trying to just um, get exposure, so I volunteered to be the stage kitten tonight. I'm picking up the bras and fans and gloves and whatever else the ladies leave on stage. <laughs> I have no character. Renee's my real name. LaRue's the add-on, but Renee's my real name is what I am. Absolutely, I got the nickname Southern Belle from hell in 12th grade. And I'm now 37, so it's carried on through the whole time. There's glitz, there's glamour you can do, but there's nothing that, you can, that can compare when a woman walks into a room with a lot of self-confidence. That's the sexiest thing they can do. Nowadays, you walk on a beach, a girl's in a thong, or topless beach, or whatever, Back in the older days, seeing an ankle was sexy. Sometimes the less you see, the more arousing and mentally stimulating and elegant and sexy. It's not always being extremely naked and hanging off of a pole. So it's preserving the art form that is stripping in its original form rather than what it's become today.